Okay, so it's Sunday night, the 31st of July 2016, and you might wonder why I'm wearing these sunglasses inside. Um, it's not because I've been punched in the face or anything. Um, I've had a virus the last couple of days and I look exhausted, absolutely exhausted, so I'm putting these on. It's a bit of vanity. But I've just had a long soak in the bath upstairs and um, I was just thinking about a few things and um, what it would be like to be in somebody else's head for just 24 hours if you could see the way they think um, and it could be your own family it could be your mum or your sister or your wife or your husband or your dad or your friends or the Prime Minister any anybody you know anybody that you know really um, just to see the way they view the world oh is that the way they see reality or um, Sneeze. <laughs> it gives it a bit of authenticity, doesn't it? Sneezing. But anyway, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, just just to see the way they view the world. So if you could if you could swap, if you could be in their head, go into their body for like twenty four hours, and you could see, oh, is that the things that they worry about? Oh, they're not things that I worry about. Or it could be, I can't believe that they don't feel bad about that or that they don't worry about that or um, or it could be the things that they get pleasure from it could be like wow do they are they really getting that much pleasure from music or anything or it could be pain are they does that really hurt them or do they really is that what their tolerance is like to um, uh, physical pain or uh, mental pain um, yeah it'd be so interesting if you could do it um, just a swap for t say 20, 24 hours or even a week and then go back to yourself with the knowledge that you've learnt about that person and I think a lot of us would maybe have a bit more empathy for people or if we could do that um, but yeah that's just my kind of thoughts on things and thanks for watching